One of the first games I ever played was SimSay 3000, and from there I have tried to play every SimSay game that I can get my hands on. Uh, along with spending a lot of time on certain say simulators. I think one of the most played games of mine is SimSay 4 with probably a good couple thousand hours, though I'm, I would suspect that by now it's probably surpassed by Minecraft, funny enough. But the point here is that I've played a lot of SimSay, I've played a lot of say simulators, I am very familiar with SimSay. And there is a version of SimSay that I have not played yet called SimSay Enhanced Edition, I think it's called. What the fuck is SimCity Enhanced Edition? Because you would think that maybe what this would do is add in, uh, I don't know, underground views, things like that, but no, it's just SimCity, but with FMV. And that sounds interesting to me, because I, I don't know about you, but I do have a, uh, a strange curiosity in FMV. Because it was what some people thought was the future for some reason. Um, clearly that wasn't the case, because FMV pretty much died out. Like, I think the last game that I heard of ever using FMV, and it was really just a stylistic thing, was a game called Roundabout. And before that, uh, Red Alert 3 comes to mind, but I mean, that, that's kind of just the staple of Command & Conquer. But hey, you know what? Maybe if you have an enhanced version on PC, it's somehow better. So, is that the case? Alright, well, here we are in DOSBox. All I have to do is just mount the uh, image. So, yeah, uh, where did I install this? I think I installed it in here, yep, uh, oops, DIR, uh, yep, SimCity CD. Alright, are you prepared for the future as it was seen in 19 whatever the fuck? It looks actually a little bit worse than uh, the Dire Straits music video. Oh my god, that is a terrible sound. Oh boy, and uh, you got some of this interesting... Just almost corruption. Alright, well, like SimCity... Uh, oh. Me click on interplay gives me, I guess, their uh, studio logo. Nice. Holy shit! That might be the longest logo I've ever seen for a game studio. Oh, and it just cuts out. Okay, what does Maxis do? Maxis always had a very simple logo. Nothing. Okay. Alright, let's just start a game. So, if you've played SimCity, you know how this works. You, uh,. Name your city. So we're going to be ironic. City of Sim. Yeah. Right, easy mode, because of course. The uh, difficulty. I love how you had easy, medium, difficult. More residential zones are needed. Thanks. All right, well, we're on island, so... Um... Nuclear plants are almost twice as expensive as a coal plant, but they generate three times the energy with a lot less pollution. Unfortunately, there is a slight <laughs> chance that a nuclear plant will experience a meltdown. Meltdowns ain't fun. Brought to you by Wikipedia, the free online encyclopedia. Residences, commercial areas, and industrial zones all- Hey bruh, roads have to be maintained by the transit budget. And if you get cheap with budget man, the roads are going to start falling apart. Is this racist? <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's a terrible sound. Yeah, this game needs more jackhammer in it. Alright, well... Ten dollars. I didn't ask how much a road was. Dollar. That is a terrible sound, holy shit. Awesome, I can't just select what sounds I want to hear. Can I hear some sounds, but not the... What the... Have you heard of black holes? That's what this city will become if you don't build more transmission lines immediately. You need a good shot from one of your very own 10 gigawatt lines. Maybe then you'd see the light. You bloody well get it. J 
Gee, thanks. Power lines, five dollars. These borders cannot build that on water. What the fuck was that? Like nuclear blast? Road, Fucking sounds $10. like Godzilla. That is, a, that is a terrible sound, man. Bulldoze, one dollar. The fuck are we now in Power Rangers? Residential. $100. They sound so fucking robotic. Jesus Christ. 12 inch pizza. $10. Foot long. $7. My electric bill. $129. Better. Industrial, happier. $100. More productive. Commercial. $100. Police station. $500. So, let's just... Uh, let's play a little bit of a thought experiment. So what happens if we... Disable sound effects, okay? That way we don't... If we're in the peak view... Okay, control P. What the fuck? What the... What the fuck was that? Residential, $100. Ah, <sighs> peace and quiet. I can finally build my city without hearing stupid shit. Yeah, because I want to hear a jackhammer all the time whenever I build a road. I want to hear all of that. Residents demand a stadium. I told you to shut up. You want a fucking stadium? Okay, fine. Let me put this, uh, yeah, let's just put this in the industrial complex. Oh. What the fuck? Good morning. This is Carol Davenport with today's weather. Floods, floods, floods. Flooding has rocked Sin City, knocking out the city's transportation and leaving citizens stranded. Many residents are finding that canoes are a fun and economical way to travel. <sighs> okay, uh, what the fuck? Residents of Sim City were greeted this afternoon with a massive flood as it roared through the downtown area leveling Sim City Mall. I'm curious. What is the sound effect for building a railroad? Oh, it can't be. What the fuck? Oh, fuck. This isn't a SimCity video without doing a disaster, so let's do the monster. And in other news today, SimCity had its Founders Day parade. Wait. This just in. Hold on. Excuse me, folks, but I am told that Funzilla is cutting a path of destruction through SimCity, devastating the transportation system. Apparently, this 20-story lizard is picking up cars and buses and throwing them hundreds of yards as he moves closer to the SimCity Action Studios, which means that this is Carol Davenport signing off and getting the hell out of here. A large lizard monster has been spotted in the water. It seems okay, to be fuck a off. Do I get to see where the lizard is? Sorry, Funzilla. Ah! There you are, Godzilla. Alright, let's try another one. Tornado! This is Action. not good. We've got a tornado destroying miles what the of fuck? transportation. We'll be mopping up this mess for a while. Wow, that was a really good edit. I'm gonna imagine if I edited something like that. Onlookers who watched the dance hall go up in smoke reportedly all held hands and sang, Burn, baby, burn, disco inferno. Burn, baby, burn, burn that mother down. Okay. Uh, yeah, that wasn't at a disco, that was at a stadium, and now it's in a factory. Fuck, imagine if City Skylines had this shit. Alright, we're gonna try a scenario. Because I'm I'm curious if 
there's uh, special clips for these. Funzilla is coming. Funzilla is coming. A large reptilian monster has been spotted heading for Tokyo Bay. It seems to be attracted to the heavy levels of industrial pollution. Try to control the fires, then rebuild. You have five years. This is Carol Davenport with this important Sim Action News Bulletin. We have good news and bad news. First, the bad news. We just learned that the legendary monster is rampaging through downtown Sim City. The good news is he's crushed the local Ida Expo office and credit card company. Three officials are trying at all costs to find what out the fuck what is to this do. accent? Mayor, if you're listening, we need your help. What the fuck is this accent? Seriously. Has been spotted fuck in off. The water. Hello, Godzilla. I'm gonna have some fun editing this video because I have a lot of music I could pick from. Aw, oh, should I have Blue Oyster Cult playing right now? Should I have the uh, Godzilla theme from 1954? Who knows? All I know is that both of those are pretty awesome options. Yeah, Godzilla's just going to the edge of the map. He's like, oh, fuck Tokyo. I don't have time for you guys. Yeah, seriously, look. He's just gone. <laughs> he just peaced out and... <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, and he's back. Alright, this an scenario airport. kind of blows. Uh, alright. New scenario. Let's try the nuclear meltdown one. This is the missing link. And without... This is what happens. How informative. A major meltdown is about to occur. Holy shit, guys, remember the 2010 the Boston meltdown? The in the vicinity of They're in the peak view. Whoa. Are we about to see... You know, that probably would have been more appropriate for the, uh, Godzilla one, but, oh well. Okay, I'm going to re reload the scenario, because I'm curious if we can get a different news clip, because that one kind of sucked. Look at me, I'm stuck in traffic. I warned you about keeping up the road budget. This city needs to move ahead. Rail service is so badly needed now. Okay. The Sim City nuclear power plant right next door to our Sim Action News studio had a meltdown today. Yeah, alright. I think that's uh, all that we need for today when it comes to Sim City enhanced CD-ROM, whatever the hell this is called. My thoughts? Ah, uh, this sucks. <laughs> um, but I think you could tell just by watching this that this kind of it's kind of, this really sucks. Honestly, I prefer my Sim City experience like this. I prefer it where you just have normal, uh, kind of zoomed in SimCity. Where you just go here, uh, I don't know, build a uh, airport. Build some of that, uh, maybe get a nuclear station. Just do shit like this. This is SimCity. Alright. That other thing, I mean, it looks like SimCity, but man, it fucking blows if that is what SimCity looks like. I'm glad that they didn't do that. With the future SimCities, I'm glad that they just kept it to, uh, well, I'm, really, I'm glad that they kept the, uh, KISS principle, you know, keep it simple, stupid. Ah, uh, because, yeah, SimCity definitely did not need FMV. Uh, games that did need FMV, I guess Night Trap, but, I mean, that's Night Trap. We're talking about SimCity, and SimCity certainly does not need any FMV. Alright, well, with that said, before I can even stop the video, I do have to...